If you think you've got it rough, meet Robert Blackman, a veteran of Vietnam who is an ex-Marine still fighting a battle, a personal one to walk again. I was shot when I was in Vietnam back in March 1968. Where were the wounds? I uh, had an anterior wound at uh, a 30 caliber round, went in my right pelvic area and came out my lower abdominal area and I blew my left hip completely out. And it was quite a fight. Out of 235 men, Robert was one of only eight to survive. Saturday, Blackman spent six hours in the operating room. It was his 29th major operation in less than eight years, and the second time doctors have put in an artificial hip, he already has an artificial knee. Bob Blackman said he would never stop fearing surgery. The minute his senses detect the distinct smell of the operating room, his mind is flooded with memories of past surgery, all painful, but not all successful. Today, he is recovering. Make sure no infection sets in. It'll be another three or four days before they know that for sure. How do you feel? I still feel a little rough. After the last hip operation, he walked for the first time in five years. But the risk of infection is greater with each such operation. But the highly decorated Marine has a lot going for him, mainly determination, trust in his doctors, and a good luck silver dollar. If all goes well, Robert should be released from the hospital within the next several weeks. If not, he'll be facing his 30th major operation. This is Sally Jasper for Channel 10 Newsbeat.